It's story time, it's story time. Do you want to hear a story? It's story time, it's story time. Do you want to hear a story? Hello, hello everyone. I am Suzette and this is Suzette's story time for children and their parents and any anybody who would love to come hear a story. Today I have a great story called My Voice is a Trumpet. <laughs> yes, My Voice is a Trumpet. And this is by Jimmy Allen and illustrated by Kathy Ann Johnson. Yeah. <laughs> So let's see, are you ready? Are you ready to see what this story is all about? Let's see. My voice is a trumpet. Some have a voice as tall as a tree, loud and proud and sways in the breeze. Some have a voice as small as a bee, soft and sweet like kisses of Honey, yes. Some have a voice that's patient and wise, with lessons of life told through sparkling eyes. Some have a voice sunny and bright, a voice that can echo and light up the night. Yes, sunny and bright, that echoes, wow, that is a powerful voice right there, yeah. And to light up the night, yeah, it's very powerful. <laughs> There's a voice that is silent but still can be heard with hands that move to speak every word. Then there's the voice that roars like a lion, a big voice that tells you always keep trying, always keep trying. Yes. So right here, this is a little girl and she is speaking with her hands. She is called sign language, yes. So she speaks to someone else who knows sign language and that is part of her voice, yes. And here's a little boy, his voice roars like a lion. Yes, roars like a lion. Yes. <laughs> We all have voices, voices to hear. My voice is a trumpet, strong and clear. <laughs> so his voice is a trumpet, yes. Doo -doo -doo. <laughs> it's strong and clear. <laughs> My voice will be proud, will be loud. <laughs> then I'm not sure I know. To wonder, to learn, and to ask as I go. To wonder and to learn and to ask as you go. Ask questions, ask questions about the world, yes. And that's how you learn. <laughs> I will learn to speak up, to show I'm strong, to stand for what's right, and to know what feels wrong. Yes, you have to know what feels wrong. Yeah. So her voice is strong. Yes, very, very strong. My 
My voice is a rainbow after the storm, loving, comforting, safe, and warm. I'll use my voice to find joy in others, reminding us all we're sisters and brothers. I'll say no to hate by using this voice and always choose love. A magical choice. Always choose love. Always choose love. It's a magical choice. Voices are powerful and together they're strong. Like the musical notes of a beautiful song. The musical notes of a beautiful song. How will you use your voice? Wow, this book was over too fast. I really, really like this book. And I hope you really, really like the book too. It was so much fun to read it. Yes, it was. My Voice is a Trumpet by Jimmy Allen and illustrated by Kathy Ann Johnson. And over here, this is our famous, famous author. He wrote the book and see his beautiful children. Yes. So I like this book. So remember that you can use your voice in all different kinds of ways, like the little girl who, had, who did sign language. She couldn't talk. So she did sign language with her hands, and I thought that was just beautiful, okay? So now it's time to go, and I hope you really, really will come back and, and hear another story with me. Please come back. So can you help me sing the goodbye song? Okay. Goodbye, goodbye, story time is over. Goodbye, goodbye, I'll see you tomorrow. I hope to see you, what? Hope to see you, what? Hope to see you tomorrow. Goodbye and goodbye to all my little friends. Goodbye. See you tomorrow and have a beautiful, wonderful day today. Okay, goodbye.